Okay. Uh, yeah, just now, just now we talk about um, uh, questions. Questions are involving algebra. So now we will take a look at this question. Okay. So whenever it comes to whenever it comes to what money, right? Money. Okay. So let's. So Amy has three times as much money as Charles. So basically, you start with what? Before you use a. Before you use what? Before you use algebra, you start with number, number first. So Amy is three times as Charles, right? So who has more? First statement. Amy has more, right? So Amy should be bigger than Charles. Yeah. Okay. So let's say Charles is one dollar. Amy is three times, right? Yeah. So Amy is how much? Four. Charles is one dollar. Three. three. How do you get three? Very good. Okay, so now Amy has three times as much as Charles, right? So let's say Charles is what? Charles is C. So is Amy. So it's three C, right? Am I right? Yeah. Ah, okay, so that means the first statement, uh, this, this statement, uh, this statement. You change it to Amy is three C, Charles is Charles is what? Where's Charles? Point your finger. Yeah. How much? Six C. Very good. Okay. So that means your this statement, ah. Uh, your this statement, you only change it to. Algebra already, which is here. So if I ask you, how much Amy has? Three. How much Charles has? Three. Okay, good. Do you need to do you need to read this again? This statement again? No. no need because you have already. Completed. Yeah. So uh, you have already converted into algebra form. Now, then we need to look at the second statement onwards. Okay. So it says. John has two times as much as Amy. John has John and Amy. Who's more? This statement. John has two times as much. John is more. Okay. So let's say if Amy is one, two times, right? John has two. How do you get two? So Amy, how much? Actually, how how much Amy has? Four. Yeah. Would, Look. Uh, point. Three C. Use your finger. Very good. So Amy is three C, right? Yeah. John has. C. Huh? How do you get C? Three C times two. Hmm. So John has. Three C times two is. Number number. Six. Mm, very good. So that means John is sixty, right? So if I ask you how much Charles has, point. How much Charles has? Charles, Charles. How much? C. How much John has? Very good. So that means now your focus uh, is here, this bracket already. The rest is just working. Okay? So, this statement, cross. Cross means you don't have to read this statement anymore. Why? Uh? Because already completed. Yes, good. So now it says what? Now let me, let me make things clearer. So your focus will be here. So let's say if next time uh, you got highlighter, you can actually highlight. Ah, this is the one I need to look at. Huh? The rest is working. Okay, good. So now this is the statement we should continue. John has 45 more than Charles. 
right? John has 45 more than Charles. What do you mean? John has 45 more than Charles. John is how much? John has... Uh, Point lah. 60. Okay, John is 60. But then he got 85 more. 85 more means what? Like, plus 85. Huh? Like, add 85 more. So John add for 85. Okay, never mind. So let's. No, yeah, I know, I know. Hold on. John has 85 more than Charles. So that means John is bigger than Charles, Charles right? So John is how much? 6. C, right? Yeah. More than. More than Charles, right? Yeah. Charles is how much? Point, point your finger. Charles is how much? 60. Charles. Oh, Charles. Where's the name Charles? I ask you to focus where? I ask you to focus the? So Charles is? C. Right? John is more than C, right? How much more? 85 more. So means 6 C, what equals to 85? Plus, minus, times, divide. I have two dollars more than you. Means I okay. I have three dollars. You have one dollars. That means I have two dollars more than you, right? Yeah. How do you get two? Uh, three minus one. Similarly, John has eighty-five more than Chow. So that means John minus three. Chow. Is 85. You, you get the point now. So here is the algebra, right? Yeah. Before you use algebra, you need to give yourself huh? a number. Example. Yes. So the number example you give yourself is I have three. Yeah. You have one. Yeah. So I have two dollars more than yeah. you. Right? Yeah. Then how do you get two? Uh, two minus one. So I have two dollars more than you, right? You, me. I have two dollars more than you, right? Yeah. How do you get two? Three minus one, right? Yeah. So similar, six C minus C equals to very good. So that means six C minus C. How many C you have? Two C. Huh? Six C minus C. Six cats minus cat. So how many cat left? You start with six cats. You minus one cat. How many cats left? Use your finger lah. Five. Yeah. So 6C minus C equals to? Five. Hmm? Five. So 5C equals to 85, right? Yeah. Give yourself a simple example. 2 times 3 equals to? 6. So C is equal to what? C is your what? The child. Yeah, I know. Matching. Three. So 3 is equal to? Three is equal to six, what? Over. over. Six over what equals to three? Mm. Mm. So similar, C is equal to? Uh, What's it? Which one is your six match? Eighty-five. Mm. Eighty-five? Over five. So eighty-five over five equals to? Eighty-five over five equals to small. Like, calculator. So 17 is your? 17 is what? 17 is for what? Charles. So Charles is here, right? Am I right? Yeah. So Amy is 3C. So Amy is how much? C is 17. So Amy is 3 times? C. Which is? 3 times what? 3 times C. 3 times C. Yeah, C is equal to? Three, okay, 3 times C is 3C, right? Yeah. So C is how much? 17. So 3 times C is... Okay, that means if C is 17, 
three C is three times what? Three times. What's the value for C? Okay, good. Six C is equal to six times. So three times seventeen equals to. So three C equals to. Three C is equal to. Six C equals to. Read. Six C. Six C equals to. Question ask me, what is the total amount money Charles and Amy have? Where's Charles? Here. Then where is Amy? Here. Amy, 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 Amy. Here. Good. Total means? Add. So we, which one add with which one? 51 plus 17. What is the answer? 68. Make sense? Okay. Okay. Good. Next. Okay. At first, Stephen twenty four more comic books than No Noel. Ah, this one is the similar. So that means you, me, you have two dollars more than me. So you have three dollars, right? Yeah. Because you have two dollars more than me, right? Yeah. So how do you get two? Steve and then Noel, right? Yeah. So it says Steve had twenty four more comic books than Noel. So twenty four is here, right? Yeah. So twenty four is equal to what? Two dollars is equal to point. Yeah. So two dollars is equal equal to. You can come closer. Point. So two dollars is equal to, or you can stand up. Yeah, sit too much really. So two is equal to. Yeah, two is equal to what? The two more. Yeah, two is equal to two more. So two is equal to what? What's the operation? Plus. Where's the plus? Two is equal to. Huh? I thought the answer is already two is equal to what? Yeah. Then just point to me lah. So two is equal to. Hmm. Can you say it more confidently? Three minus one. Two is equal to. Three minus one. So twenty four is equal to. Point 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 point. Twenty four is equal to. Similar what? Two is equal to three minus one, right? So twenty four is equal to. Steve minus Noel. Very good. Don't sit down. Don't sit down. Okay. Okay. Good. So that means this statement. Gone. Next statement. Noel gave fifteen of his comic books to Steve. Okay. Good. So that means, can I ask you, Steve is A. Okay. Then Noel is what? So that means Steve is A. Okay. Noel is how much? So Steve is A. So it means Steve changed to. A. Yeah, because two is equal to three minus one, right? Yeah. So that means now twenty four is equal to Steve minus Noel, right? Yeah. So Noel now is A, right? So Steve need to change to. Change to. A. Hmm. 
So no L equals to 什么？说诺维尔三百七。A minus 诺维尔 is twenty four。说诺维尔三百七。说 twenty four is equal to A minus 诺维尔 ，right？ 说诺维尔 equals to A minus twenty four。Because Steve has twenty-four more, ma. Understand? Okay. I give you one minute. Go and wash your face. Come back. Don't move here and there. I I need you to. If you need a cold water, go and get a cold water. One minute. Go and settle. Quick. Come back fresh. When you wash your face, wash with water. Ah. Hmm. You know how to handle, right? I teach you last time already, right? Yeah. Hmm. No need to wash too much. Just splash a bit. Splash with some water on your face. Hey, Mama. Next time you have to ask him this question. Next time you have to ask him this question. It's a little bit. Okay. It's a little bit. It's a little bit. It's a little bit. Let's say this one. I have $10. Okay? I have $10. And then I have $2 more than you. Okay? Okay. 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 Okay? Let's say that's all. Twelve. How do you get twelve? Let's say that's all. Eight. How do you get eight? Okay. So, yeah. You, you just want to do what? Okay. Okay. Come back. You just want to do what? Oh, my. You, you just want to do what? Number can you change? So. I have a uh, one bottle of one liter milk, okay. Then uh, I drink two hundred milliliter away. How much is left? Oh. Ah, just this. Oh. 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 I found that this sound is a little bit slow. If I have 10 bucks, I'll give you 2 bucks. How much is it? Do you understand how to add or reduce? It's going to be a long time. Yes. For example, I have 10 bucks, I'll give you 2 bucks. Do you think it's easier to add or reduce? If he hears more, he will definitely add. Is it right? I have 2 dollars more than you. I have 10. I have 2 dollars more than you. He says 10 plus 2. It's wrong. 我比你多了，你一定比我少啊！他每次讲到 more 就是就不说，所以你不能一看到 more 就是，就、啊、是不是女人就是我妈妈那种，你懂我意思吗？要变通。说的意思我一定比你少吗？啊、对不对？说我不可能讲 twelve 吗 ？twelve 就比你多了，那就不是 make sense 啊？对吧？说你一定要考他这种。记得嘛？这个不用背了，这种是慢慢的要一直问。嗯，说、so、你比我多了，说、嗯 so、我一定是 ten more than that， right？ 加了。对，那就加了。好，不是因为 more 就是加。有时要看 u 还是 u， 嗯。Yes。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。Okay。
Okay. Okay, good. So now let's come back to this question. Huh? Mm. Okay, hey, come, focus. So so let's say uh Steve had twenty four more book than Noel, right? So Steve is more than Noel, right? Right? Yeah. Mm. So just now I say right, you me, right? Yeah. So you have three dollars, I have one dollar, so you have two dollars more than me, right? Am I right or not? Okay. So you have two dollars more than me. Right? So it means this this statement uh, is actually three minus one. Right? Yeah. So if this statement is Steve, so that means the statement changed to so this statement means three minus one. So this statement changed to Steve has 24 more than Noel. So this statement you change to Steve minus Noel equals to 24. Similarly, because you use the number example, 3 minus 1, 9 equals to 2, right? Yeah. So here, similarly, you use the... So just now, you 2, how do you get 2? Right? Use your finger, follow. How do you get 2? You get? Two. Then, similarly, how do you get 24? S minus N. Very good. Because over here is 3 minus 1. So similarly, S minus N. So S minus N equals 24. So I write it down first. Okay? Now, then, can I ask you, if... If... So Steve and Noel. So let's say Steve is A. So Steve is A. So that means your this equation, uh, your this equation becomes S minus what? S minus A equals to 24, right? Because Noel is A, what? So I replace. Uh. So S minus A equals 24. So S equals to more. Yeah, so S is Steve, right? So Steve equals to small. S minus A equals 24. So S is? 24. Mm -hmm. Minus. Minus? A. 24 minus A. So, okay, you always have this problem. Whether it's 24 plus or minus. So, plus or minus, how do you decide? You give yourself a? Okay, so give yourself what, what simple example you give yourself then? Minus the line color. Uh, then. then minus. You have sense. Seven. Seven equals to? Mm, good. So that means S equals to. So here S is your what? It's not ten. Ten. So how do you get ten? Three plus S. Three plus seven. So similarly, twenty four minus A or twenty four plus A. Plus. Okay. Good. So this is not correct. So S equals to twenty four plus A, right? Okay. Okay, good. Now, then now, that means we have already done this statement. Now, next statement. Noel gave 15 of his book to Steve. Okay, good. Gave, right? Gave means what? Gave means? Give. We can use branch already. Okay, remember? The branch method. Can you remember branch method? Yeah. Okay, let's start with branch method now. Steve is this, right? Noel is this, right? Yeah. So Noel give what? 15, right? Yeah. This is give away, right? So if Noel is A, gave 15 away, how much is left? For Noel. 
Start with A, K15 away. K means what? What operation? It's minus. Minus. So is what is left? How much is left? You start with A, K15, A. 15. a. Minus 15. Very good. So Noel, this is Noel left, huh? Then now, Steve is 24 plus A, right? Yeah. So, Noel gave 15 to Steve. So, means Steve receive. Receive, right? Right? Yeah. Receive 15 from Noel, right? Noel. So, how much is left? So, you start with 24 plus A, you receive 15. So, how much is left? 4. Steve. What's the operation? Receive what operation? Plus. So which one plus which one? Use your finger quick. Which one plus which one? Point. Fifteen. Yeah, plus. Plus what? Twenty-four plus A. Very good. So that means fifteen plus twenty-four plus A. Right? So fifteen plus twenty-four. You can simplify or not. Number 1 plus 2 is? 3 5 plus 4 is? 9 hmm, So that means this one you can change it to 39 plus A That's left Okay, so that means Steve left is this one Noel left is? Which one? Like, use your finger to point Noel left is how much? A minus 15 Very good, so now what? That means this statement done deal already. Right? Now, it says, Steve has twice as many as Noel. So, who has more? Steve. How much more? Three times. So, that means S is equal to N times 3, right? Yeah. So, it means Noel times 3 equals to this one, right? Yeah. Okay, good. So, how much is Steve left? Where is Steve left? Point your finger. Steve. Left. Which one? 39 plus 8. Mm. So I replace. Noel left. Noel left is 8 minus mm, 15. Good. So bracket. So you can have this equation already, right? Okay, so now we need to solve this equation. Okay. What is this? What do you need to do? First arrow. Second arrow. Second arrow. So first arrow you get ah this one copy down. That means whatever you never do anything, right? Just copy down. So first arrow you get what? Eight times three. three. Minus sign copy up. Fifteen times three. Six. Okay? So here. A and A. So this is the equal sign, right? This, this side is called the what? What? This 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 is called the left hand side. Left hand side. So short form is LHS. Then this one is called the. This is the what? Right hand side. Right hand side of the equal sign, right? Yeah. So it's called the right hand side. So short form is. What's the short form? RHS RHS Okay, so next time when I say LHS, what it means? LHS is left hand side Left hand side of the? Equal side Very good, so the left hand side is this The right hand side is this Right, okay now uh, Today What do you learn? You have learned the Each number total table That's number one Number two, algebra. Yeah. Right? So today I want to teach you the third method which you move you move things from left to right or right to left. So basically you need to move move things over to the other side. Okay? When you move from the left to the right, that means over already. Right to the left means over already. Okay? So when you move when you move, you need to, so as long as you move, once, once you move over to
to the other side you need to change the sign okay so plus 2a do you know the plus is the sign have you learned okay minus 2a minus is the sign so this is called the sign okay so in this case can I ask you here's 39 right yeah then can I ask you this plus uh, this plus this plus belongs to 39 or it, plus, it, it belongs to a which one it belongs to the plus Thirty nine or A? Do you know? No, no. Okay. Look, uh, we are queuing up. Okay, compare. Thirty nine is me, right? Okay. A is A is okay. you. Plus is the which is in front of you. Yeah. So what is in front of you? Thirty nine. Yeah, lah, but. The nine is in, in front of you, right? Yeah. But the plus is in front of A, right? Yeah. So what is in front of you now? The plus. Touch. Yeah, I mean here. What's in front of you? Touch. What's in front of you? The chair. Yes, good. So that means you just imagine you are queuing up. Okay? To answer the question. Whether the uh, to answer the question the plus belongs to thirty nine or A. So this is the first person. Okay. So this is the second person. Okay. Okay. So let's say you see a two dollar here. You see a two dollar here. Can I see the two dollar there? Why? Why I cannot? Because you're facing it. Right? Yeah. So the two is behind me already, right? Yeah. I cannot see, right? Yeah. So why you can see the two dollar? Because you can see it, right? Because it's in front of you. So do you think I will take the two dollar or you will take the two dollars? Uh, I will take the. You will take the two dollars. Right? So that means the plus belongs to. A. Yes, the reason is just like this example. Because whatever is behind the first person, right? The person has no visibility of it. Let's say there is a gold bar behind. The person cannot see what. Whatever is behind the person, irrelevant. So the plus sign belongs to A. A. So similarly, this is 3A, right? Then I ask you, the minus sign belongs to who? 45. Why? Because, mm. uh, three, uh, because I, uh, the minus sign is behind the 3A, right? Yeah. So whatever behind the 3A, it doesn't matter already. Because if you, you just look at it from a Q perspective, right? The $2, right? behind the first person the, fir the first person can't see so the two dollar can only be picked up by the second, second person. person so that means the minus sign belongs to 45 so that's why you can see what you can start to see one term two term three term and four terms okay so now please repeat this once you move over to the other side mm. Change mm. sign. Change sign. Which one is the sign? Addition. Huh? The, the, the plus sign or the minus sign. Very good. So can I ask you? When you want to okay, when you want to move, right? That means you want to okay, you see this is what? Number. Yeah. This is? Letter. This is? This is what? Three letter. Letter. This one? Number. I will say okay. That means this is number pure number this is letter right yeah. 3a is letter this one is pure number right yeah. so when you move things or when you want to group things do you want to group similar things together or you want to group different things together similar things, similar things. So that means that means you are trying to say it's good that i can bring my number over right okay good so can i ask the 39, you want to put it here, right? Then you copy down. Did you change? Did you did you move? Did you move or not? So if you never move, do you need to change the sign? Move, change. No move? No change. Very good. So 39? No move. 
no change. Just copy, right? Yeah. You want to move the? Wait, wait, wait. What is this? This number is a? 45 or minus the 45? Minus. Like use your finger. Why minus 45? Why not 45? Use your finger, touch. What did I say just now? Why minus 45? Why not 45? I ask you to put your finger there, don't move. Okay, so this is what number? 45. 45 or minus 45? 45. Then the minus sign belongs to who? Belongs to the 45. So you should say this is? Minus 45. So it's minus 45 or 45? Minus 45. Why? Because the minus sign belongs to 45. Very good, so that's why this is? A so you want to move, right? Move where? Move, huh? Move where? Like, show your show the show the action with your finger. Move to. Go, go, go. Stop here, right? Did you move over already? Yeah. So when you move forward, you need to. Change. So here is minus forty five. When you move over, becomes. Plus what? 45. Very good. So that means the 45 here already? No more. Because you only move. Yeah. When you move, you need to? Change sign. So just now it's minus. Yeah. So now it becomes? Plus. Very good. So now, do you want to move the 3A? Or you are satisfied with 3A? 3A. You need to move or? No need, so just move. Copy down. Yeah. Okay, good. You want to move the this one, right? Yeah. To where? Show your finger. So, you move what? Plus A. So you move. Did you move over? Yeah. So when you move over, you need to. So plus A becomes. Minus. So three apple minus apple is. You have three apple, you minus one apple, then it equals to? Two apple. Two apple. 39 plus 45, 84. So I give yourself, so you always have this problem. You don't know whether it's times or divide, right? So what you do? Simple example. Six is equal to two times. Three. Okay, so in this case, A is equal to what? So A is your what for this? Three. Three equals to what? Mm. Three is equal to? Six divided by two. So similarly, A equals to? Uh, two. A. Three, use your finger, right? Three is equal to? A. Yeah. So A equals to? Match. This is your, f this is your simple example to help you. So A is equal to what? Two. Three is equal to. A. No, three is equal to some more. Six or one. So, use your finger. Point. Three is equal to? Six. Where is your six in this case? Like, show me. So A is equal to? So similarly, A equals to? Uh huh. Over. Over what? Why? Why? Yep. So, so show me lah. You use your finger. Okay, I want you to use your finger. Okay, I don't know why you will stop using. Use your finger. Show me. Show me the movement. Mm. Yep. Okay. Very good. And then. 
So eighty four. Explain, organize your thoughts, then explain one time, clearly, okay? With your fingers. When you're ready, show me with your finger. Ready? Ready? Yeah. Go. Uh, three is A. Mm, okay, three is A, okay. Four. So? Three is A. Three is A, okay. Mm. It's okay, six is eighty-four. Like, right? where's your six? Here. Okay, six is okay. 84. Okay, good. Then two. Two, two is what? Two. two is the what? Two, two is eight. two. Point two is what? Two is the two A. Two is what? Like. Two is two A or two. Start matching first. Mm. Start. Mm. Mm -hmm. Repeat loudly, confidently. Mm. Two is the A, two mm. is the two. Last statement. Two, two is the. Two. Okay, good. Continue. Line. So. Tell me. So. Uh, mm. the, the, the two is the two. Two is the two. Two is the two, right? Yeah. Or two is the two A. So A equals to what? Use your finger to point because I find you are very distracted. Value. A equals to what? Your finger don't move. Stop the finger at A. Okay, so what is the value of A? I never ask you to move your finger, I ask you to answer only. So what's the value of A? 84. So which is? Mm. Yeah, now you can use your calculator. Mm. So A equals to? 42, right? Yeah. Okay, now we can answer question already. A equals to 42. Okay, so they want what? Steve, where's Steve? Steve is here. At first. Where's at first? That means Steve starting is which one? Where's at starting is what? Starting. This one is what? Left or starting? This number is left or starting? Left. Then you go to the starting law. Where is the starting? Okay, good. So, 24 plus A is starting, right? Yeah. For Steve, right? Yeah. What's the value of A? Where is the value for, for A? Use your finger point. A equals to what? That means you need to look for A equals to a number. Is there anything here? A On this slide? Here. Uh, A equals to? 42. Huh? 42. So A equals to? 42. So Steve at the start is? Which is? 2 plus 4. 
2 plus 4 is 6. 4 plus 2 is 6. So the answer is You are very distracted. Okay? Not that you don't know. You are very distracted. Why? I can tell from this example. 6 is. 6 is what? 84. Use your finger to show me. 3 is. 2 is. The first attempt you say 2 is equal to. Why? Why? You, you, you were very distracted, right? That's why I keep asking you to do what? Do what? Match. By using? Yeah. 3 is my A, right? 6 is my 84, right? Yeah. 2 is my? 4. Then why you keep saying 2 is my 2A? It doesn't, it doesn't make sense. 2 is 2, right? Can you see or not? Right on top. 3 is? 3. A, right? Right on top, right? Yeah. Then how can 2 is your 2A? So next time when I ask you, you need to use what? Match. And very good. When I ask you what is the value of A, value of A, right? Yeah. Should be here, right? Yeah. Should be here, right? Yeah. Then why you move like here? So what's the value of A? What's the value of A? I want the simplified answer. When I ask you for what is the value of A, you need to give me the simplified answer. 42. So next time when I say what is the value of A, you give me? 42. Yes, you straight away. Yeah. Don't give me in the middle. Okay? Good. So come here. What's Steve at the beginning? 24 plus 42. What is Steve at the end? 39 Which is? What is Noel at the beginning? A. What is A? 42. So what is Noel at the beginning? 42. Very good. What's the Noel at the end? 42 minus Very good. You are so much better with your finger. Right now. Just now you are so distracted. Oh, where, where, where can I find? Next time when you find, right, use your finger. Okay? Focus. Okay? People ask you for what is the beginning of Steve? Okay, Steve is here. Beginning? Yeah. Right? Not like, oh, keep, 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 keep going. Okay, can? Very good. So, yep, today, what you have learned so far, I'll give you a summary. Or you give me, tell me what you have learned so far. What's the number one thing you learned? The table. Yep, so this is each number total table right before you do that algebra what you do first you give your allowance what's your day allowance three how many days five. so total three times five. yep so after you give your this example then you only then you then you give the question example to this table okay this is number one what you have learned number two algebra Right? The, 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 the times and plus. And the open? Bracket. Very good. Okay. And then number three. Number three is? The, the, I say move. I move, yes. So when you move, what you need to do? Very good. So let's say you have this. Let's say you want to move the A over, right? Yeah. Must move what? Move over. Over what? Over the? Equal sign. Okay, so this is called the? So this is the equal sign, right? Yeah. This side is called the? Yeah. Side. Then this side is called the? Right hand side. Very good. So in this case, when you want to move the A over, so that means... Did you move 2A? 
You want to move what? You want to move the A over, right? Yeah. So that means the two A. Move or no move? No. Okay. So no move must copy. So A, you move over becomes. You you start with plus A. You move over, you must change. The two minus. Minus. Then can I ask you the plus belongs to three or what? Three. Belongs to three, right? Yeah. Yeah. So plus three. So two A minus A equals two. So A equals to? One. A equals to what? Point your finger. Point your finger. A equals to? Three. Okay, where, where do you get one? Where do you get one? Where do you find the one? You see? Once again, you show you are distracted. What's the value of A? Three. Next time when I ask you what's the value of A, what you need to do? Use your finger, point to that. Okay? Not in your dream. Okay? Okay, good. So, Take this, go back, and take a look at. So watch it again at home, so you have a better understanding of what you have learned today. Okay, okay. So today is uh, algebra one. Okay, good. That's it.